What is up everybody and with a new Namco Bandai presentation comes another reveal. Today is Warang. Um, I saw the thumbnail, I still haven't seen it, but he looks different, he, like hair down, he's no longer blind in one eye. So hopefully like what it would, would kind of be cool would be like if he's like, he has a lot of like back stuff, right? Like the butterfly kick that he has, some some of the chops, right? Because they already gave him his his ruha, that that crazy ass kick. So may, like if they gave him like that crazy hell sweep out of the flamingo, that would be sick too. Oh, anyways, rambling. Let's go. Let's go see exactly what Warang is like. Have a motorcycle. Get ready for the next battle. Ooh, audio kind of loud. Yeah, that's what I saw. Yeah, he looks yoked too. To give him the chiseled chin, big thick neck. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, that's a good backlash here. That's a. Okay, they gave him. They gave him back kick. Cool last low they gave him. Back butterfly kicks also. And the karate chop. Okay, so so far so good as far as the back hybridization right there. Oh, that's tight. Yeah, it's another back. Oh, yeah, they're giving him a lot of shit. Alright, that was a short combo. Okay, he engaged on the floor. That new kick looks tight. Oh. At least they gave down 4 4 on use. Oh, that's a new extension on top. Yo, these animations are super fluid. Alright, there's the Wu Ha. You're getting yell though. Damn! How much air time did they give the dude? He was in the air for like 10 seconds. Uh, that was kinda cool. That rage art was pretty dope. I like all the back stuff they gave him. Huh. Alright, so let's download this and let's look at it slower. So through the magic of editing. All right, future me is here now. So what we're gonna do now is look at this section by section and in slow motion and see what we can pick up that we didn't see during the initial view. Get ready for the next battle. Section eight, new. All right, down three, four, into the new low, into the backlash. The first thing, backlash got hella nerfed because there's no full combo anymore. Now it's just a standard four, four, three afterwards. That's a good nerf, very warranted. I know Warangs out there are going to be hating everybody about it, but that move was a little broken at times, so... Yeah. Alright, so that looks like a new homing. Um, is that the three kick? It looks like maybe a new animation for up three. Right, and then right foot forward one or two into, uh, into flamingo. And then into punch parry for Bayox, uh punch parry. And then into the butterfly kicks. Interesting. It might be scarier to mash against him now. Alright, counter hit low still gives a juggle and he has like a lead pickup. The glee's down three is it down three three or down back three three? That looks so cool. Okay, four, four. Oh maybe that's a new animation for down back four forward. And then hunting hawk into the spike. Alright, so let's look at this again. Four four. Four into a new extender four. 
screws into hunting hawk okay that sequence was very boring okay so bayox butterfly kicks spike and instantly goes into flamingo oh, you can't tell because of the camera and then karate chop okay so yeah you can't tell if he, if he automatically goes into flamingo stance afterwards so then while standing two three and then the power crush canceled into I wonder how fast he can cancel the flamingo into the karate chop because Bea used to be able to do that super fast and it was super annoying. And he's looking pretty giga buffed. This new special intro is so tight. <laughs> Alright, so it starts with stun. Okay. Okay, so the heat bound. Is the it looks like the, it's like the running three animation, but with the right leg. Yeah. And then forward to air throw. Yeah. Okay. Pretty straightforward by the looks of it. All right. So let's look at this again. Stun jab into the new up three. So two three does that now. Or is that a new? St I don't know. I don't know. I'm not much of a warring player. I just know that with Yoshi, uh, we can generally interrupt most things. But I'm not seeing any window. All right. Okay. So Jin pressed. So he can do that new kick out of the flamingo. And then they give down four four a use finally as the combo extender. Yeah, it looks like he can do that directly out of flamingo. And then the power cards down four to three four. Okay, Gager. Yeah, it's either that or it's a string. Because it was really fluid. Then down 4-4. Four, four. And then the power crush. Okay. Alright, let's do it again. Forward 4, back 3. It, it looks like it might be a string now. Like down four, three, four, four, or down four, three, four, three, or three plus four, or something. Oh, the gut punch on counter hit doesn't stun. It just gives a fault like a uh, frame advantage. That was tight. That looks kind of guaranteed. That was mad fast. And that low, so I guess in heat, that low insta trips. Right, this low right here. Yeah, because I don't think it knocked down when, when he was not in heat. Yeah, it's hella plus, so you can't push after that thing at all. Up, it looks like up three, but with the right leg this time. So up four, maybe? So like they're giving him a lot of like transitions into different into the rifle forward or rifle mingo stance. Yeah, that was tight too. So four 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 is a heat engager. Okay, that's a meaty one too. Three three four. Ruha. And then hunting hawk into flamingo. That is tight. And now only flamingo, right flamingo. Three, three, four. Ooh, ha. Hunting hawk, right flamingo, forward four, I guess. That's kind of cool. And then the rage art that homeboy is like Michael Jordan doing like 50,000 kicks in the air for 10 seconds. That, that is a tight freaking ass uh, rage art though. But yeah, overall, Homeboy looks buff, both visually and move-wise. Um, Backlash nerf is kind of cool. Um, the nerf on the counter hit forward 1 plus 2 is also... Is it forward 1 plus 2 or is it down forward 1 plus 2? No, down forward 1 plus 2 is that weird little punch. But either way, so that doesn't give a full combo. It just gives hella frames by the looks of it. And his heat gimmick, I, I'm guessing it's like... That quick little low actually juggles. Who knows what else he gains when he's in heat. 
they didn't really show much. The other thing that I noticed was like um, in heat when you were blocking, you were glowing hella red. So maybe you get extra chip damage during heat, maybe. Maybe that's one way to balance Warring's heavy button play style in heat. Um, but like overall, his transition into Tekken 8 Warang looks very cool. Like you can tell they spent a lot of time reanimating a lot of things. So I wonder what made the list and what didn't make the list for this new game for him. Because he had like a million moves. So yeah. Overall, very cool trailer. Um, hopefully this little breakdown helped a little. Um, but then, granted, like, I'm not much of a Warang player. I play against a lot of Warangs. And I know how to punish Warangs. So the main thing from what I was seeing is that there wasn't a lot of holes where you can squeeze a flash. But the holes were still existent in his strings. To where, like, if Yoshi still has his um, side step one, you can probably still squeeze that in there. So Yoshi's still good there. All the Bayak stuff was really cool. Like it's an it's a nice combination of Bayak's move list and Warang's move list. So overall, very flashy, very cool trailer. So yeah, guys, thank you again for watching. Uh, if you're not a sub, subscribe, and if you like the video, like it. If you don't, don't like it. Either way, appreciate your time. Peace.